This video will show you how to resolve a vector into its component vectors graphically. This is effectively the opposite of adding vectors graphically. We have 9 centimeters north 48 degrees east. First thing we need to do is put in our direction. Then we're going to mark off where we'd like to start our vector. And grabbing our protractor, we're going to measure north 48 degrees east. and put a mark and using our ruler I'm going to draw that vector in there And we're going to make it 9 centimeters long. 9.0 centimeters long as accurately as we can. From there, we're going to draw just a very light line here. Not a vector, just a line past the tip of this vector. Uh, when you're doing it in your notes, you can do that just in real light pencil, just as long as you can see it. Then you're going to take your protractor, place it along that line, and line it up so that the nine, a line going straight up 90 degrees would go through the tip of this vector. To make it a little easier to see, you can use your ruler to help you line that up. By placing your ruler along the 90 degree line and making sure it goes through the tip of your vector. Then you're going to grab your pencil Put a little mark up there, or you could put one down here too. The reason you're doing that is so that when you move these out of the way, you can pull your ruler back in, line it up, and you know that this is now a 90 degree angle. Draw a vector from this line up to the tip of your beginning vector, then measure it, and we see that it is, looks like 6.0 centimeters long. This is nine centimeters, sorry, nine point zero centimeters. Then using your ruler, draw in and measure the east component of the vector. We see that it is approximately 6.7 centimeters long. So our answer, 9.0 centimeters north 48 
degrees east resolves to or equals you could do as well six point zero centimeters north plus 6.7 centimeters east. And that's your final answer. <laughs>